Hello and welcome to another Yoldi Battles More Time Report number 45. We're on the last cycle of our third phase, if that's the right terminology. Yeah. Um, so basically, this is yeah, this is the third round for each of these warbands. Um, so in this cycle, it's Orcs, Skaven, and Witch Hunters. And for this first game out of this, it's my Orcs versus Phil Skaven. Um, mine's called Damob. Yours is Elf Nibblers. Elf Nibblers. I haven't got any elves, that's fine. Yeah. <laughs> um, we're playing Surprise Attack. I don't think this one very often, this is quite a bit of a rarer one. So we thought we'd give it a go. So that's where there's a defender who deploys a random number of their mob, or their, their sort of their mob, their warband, anywhere on the board, not within eight of each other. And then the opposing warband comes on from one board edge. And it's, it's just routing after that, so it's quite an easy. Yeah. Easy one. Um, I think that's it. Don't try to try to vary our boards between cycles. Um, so this is kind of a outskirts of more time, I'd say. Some weird looking trees. Okay, so we'll have a look at the warbands next, um, and we'll try and remember to give our warband ratings. Here's my orc and goblin warband, Damob. Doing well points wise. I uh, haven't lost a game yet, but I feel this may be the first. <laughs> I worry about your scaven. So I've got my uh, orc boss, Dabos, axe, sword, helmet, lucky charm, step aside, plus one wound, plus one attack, plus one weapon skill. It's pretty good in combat now. Um, the olden, shaman, club free dagger, plus one wound, plus one weapon skill. He's got two spells, clubber and zap. So clubber kind of makes him better in combat, which is a bit rubbish. And zap is, um, well, sounds like, like a lightning spell. And then got uh, the next one is the biggin, oh the big boy, um, two clubs plus one weapon skill step aside, mean eye bow blunderbuss club free dagger, weapon expert so that's how he's got a blunderbuss, eagle eye so his blunderbuss is really long range, and step aside as well. And then I've got henchmen groups shooters, two goblin archers, they've got short dagger and short bow and dagger, plus one strength, plus one initiative, rubbish. Then I've got uh, clubbers, plus one strength. Why is that the only thing they've got? They should have two things. Oh yeah, no, last time they leveled up and got, dad's got talent at one and got killed. <laughs> um, I've then got one orc boy, this guy, who has got axe, bow, free dagger. He's not leveled up yet, he must be, yeah, he's new. Yeah, I bought him last time, so he's not leveled up yet. Tool. And I've got some cave squigs, my troll, he's called Bristlenose, and last of all my warlock, who's usually the MVP of my games, um, free dagger star, fires of Azul, silver arrows of Aya, which are both the best two spells you can get really for a warlock, and plus on bliss skill as well, so that's good. Okay, and the warband rating, I think, if this is right from last time, is 192. Okay, this is my Skaven, the Elf Nibblers. Um, we have Nibbles, four clock pistol, sword and shield. He has Eagle Eyes, Hunter, Trick Shooter. What's Eagle Eyes plus six range? Plus six range. Trick Shooter is ignores cover. Oops, Hunt. Sorry, I accidentally just pressed, drop my phone and press stop. Okay. Um, so I guess go that. So Eagle Eyes plus six inch range, Hunt, uh, Trick Shooter is ignores cover. So like Hunter, I need to change it, it should be pistol here. Basically, he can shoot every turn. Okay. I think Hunter's just for the rifles. Oh, okay. The wrong one name, but. Okay, that's all. Uh, minus one weapon skill. Okay. Um, then who you got next? Scorch. Scorch. Spear and dagger. Um, one spell, Norden. Um, he has sorcery, so it's only a six to cast now. Plus one attack. Mm. He's hardened. Um, the new hero, Snuffles. Uh, Sword Mace Sling, plus two Ballistic Skill. Oh my god. So he's Ballistic Skill 6. There's a, you said he's a new hero? Oh, did he get promoted? Yes, yeah. He's oh, a okay. lad's got talent one. Oh, okay, this cool. Is the first time I've used that model. Oh, okay, Probably. cool. Yeah. And seven... And it just said, it said, Phil actually made that sling. I think it's quite cool. He's got a bit of... Find, find a bit of warpstone. He's Because he's blind, I think. Got... Yeah. Uh, okay. Seven. 
Sword Club Slave. Um, plus one attack, basically. Okay. Um, which one is that? Cleave is the first one. Cleave. Cleave is the one with claws. Okay. It has the art of silent death. Um, plus, yeah, it gives them basic plus two attacks. And crits on a five. Ooh. Then blood claw, just the swords, plus one weapon skill, plus one strength, but minus one toughness. Toughness two? Toughness two, yeah. Okay. Yeah, hit him before I hit you. Yeah. Um, and then come, we'll come to this one last. All right. Which one you want? Uh, Ruskin. Ruskin, one Ruskin, sword mace sling, plus one ballistic skill, plus one leadership. Two fan king, mace and sling, they're new, so nothing on them. Okay. One. Jabkin. Well, oh, I should have two Jabkins. Okay. Uh, mace sword sling, plus one strength, plus one weapon skill. Okay, we'll grab another one in a second. Three giant rats. Three giant rats. And then Veskit. Veskit. Awesome. I love this model as well. Every time you bring it, I like this such a cool model. Awesome. Cool. And what my rating is? Um, 252 plus another Ruskin. Uh, 258. It was uh, the Jabkin, oh, wasn't it? 263. Jabkin. Maybe another five as well. Uh, Jabkin, the brown ones, this one. Yeah. So it does mean that I'll get plus one experience on everything, which is kind of cool. Um, okay. Let's... We'll we'll come back after the deployment. We'll we'll roll off camera for who's to attack and defend and all that kind of stuff. Cause it's a bit slow, so basically we'll come back in a moment when you'll see some random models deployed everywhere, and then one will band deployed on the board edge. Okay, and we're deployed. So I'm just spread out along here, trying to spread out my animosity causing ones as much as possible. A couple up here, and then it's hard to say where all fills are. There's one under here, right there. Has a guy under there somewhere. Scorch is there, no, Rat, no, Veskit, no. Leader's under there. There's one here, one there, one there. Five over there. Five over there. Phil rolled fairly well, actually. Most of his warband didn't come on, which actually made it quite hard to deploy them. Yeah. Because <laughs> he had lots to deploy. It was like, ended up with loads of giant rats. <laughs> um, so yeah, so I automatically go first. So we're going to get some turn one charges off. Um, we'll do um, stupidity and animosity off camera. And we'll come back when we're ready to do some shooting, basically. So we'll do some movement and then we'll come back for shooting. Uh, coming at actually a little bit into the shooting phase of turn one. Oh, I know, I, know, oh, I did fire the goblin. So I'll move these guys up a little bit to get them a bit closer. They both fired at that Skaven. Goblin missed. This guy needed a seven to hit, which for us is a six and a four. Got a six to hit. Then rolled another six to get that second hit. So we hit, got a six to wound. Then got a six for the type of crit. Then I will double two. So I only stunned him, sadly. Yeah. But I thought it was going to be a perfect turn one and just murder that guy. He's stunned. We're just out of the game for two turns, basically. Yeah. So not so bad. A couple of charges off, though. Troll got in there. Lead and a squig in there. Squig and another guy in there. Other shots. This goblin fired and missed. And that's it. So I'm now on to magic. I'm doing a zap on Scorch. So I need a nine for this to go off. I'm going to do it here. Nine goes off. That is that is D three strength four hits with no armor save. So D three hits three. These dice won well, a lot of sixes. A concerning amount of sixes. Mm. Given how many U sixes you rolled, yeah. The, come on, might want to check these dice. So it's three strength four hits. Toughness three. Three. No, only one wound. No armor saves, and it takes them out. <laughs> I would feel bad, but I don't. It's going to be a short night. Well, yeah, I don't know. I never know with orcs. Um, okay, I'm going to check the range of her spell, whether she can see anything. Um, so I'll come back in a second. So after that, my wall did get silver arrows of eye off, but didn't do it well. It actually hit this guy and did wound. I got one wound, and then just knocked him down. He's already stunned, so it didn't really matter. Troll, combat time. Three attacks, two hits. Do you have a sword? Uh, yes. So you can, I got a four and a five, so you can try and parry the four. Nope. Nope, three. Twos to wounds. Two wounds. Any armor? Well, in, no. no, not enough armor. No. And it is take out twice. Sorry. Yeah. 
two heroes down. That is two heroes down, which is a bit tragic, really. Right, let's go with my uh, boss. He's a big enough who, who's killed stuff as well. Um, boss has got two attacks, which I'll do with the... Actually, I'll do them at the same time, it won't make any difference. Weapon skill five against weapon skill... What is it? A rat? A rat. A rat. No, weapon skill two. So I think I hit you on three still? Four, five. Five. I'm just going to check that actually. Yep, still threes. Um, I couldn't remember to be honest. Um, yeah, do you see if I have one attack? Must do. Yep. Okay, so three attacks anyway. Hitting on threes. Two hits. Strength, four. Toughness, three. So threes to wound. One wound. Stunned. And then the squig will the squig will kill it. Yep. He's dead. I think that's up. Yeah. And then in here, I might actually go with the squig first this time. Squigs have got only one attack. Um, weapon skill four against weapon skill. I don't even know who's in there. Okay. Awesome. Right. I'll roll if I get yeah. it. So four, so hits, toughness. Oh, got parry. Oh, okay. Parries. Yep, parries. Okay, well I'll do my other guy then. He's the big one. He's got two clubs, so he's got two attacks. I'm just got five. It's on threes. One hit. You can try and parry on a six. Nope. Oh. Strength. I think three. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry, Phil. What kind of crit? The the good kind. And he's dead as well. Okay, it's plus yeah. two. Wow, that's four things in turn one. Right, and one guy stunned. Yeah. Okay. Um. Okay. Where's is what it is. I I I've always said that this one's a bit weighted in favour of the. Attacker, but we'll see. You never know; things can turn around. So, yeah, it's four things out, including two heroes, which is a bit tragic for Phil so far. But Vesk is still on the board, and he, he's absolutely terrifying. So, um, on to Skaven, turn one. Okay, I think this is the record for the shortest game we've ever had, uh, and over turn one, <laughs> Phil lost four models. So he had to get a turn. <laughs> Phil didn't get a turn. He started moving, and then we realised he had to take a route test, which he failed. Um, it's a bit rubbish because it's, we've set up all this terrain and done all the setup and stuff, and then it's literally over turn one. Um, but that's what it's what that's more time that happens. Um, I will definitely put a comment in the description that this is a very short game. Mm -hmm. Um, so yeah, that's it really. Next game will be either Skaven or Orcs versus Witch Hunters. Um, We'll do the normal scrolling summary. As we were talking at the beginning of this, that I'm not a fan of surprise attack because it seems to be very swingy. Um, like I got lucky that came on this side. I happened to come on against three. If I come on that side, it'd have been Veskit facing me. Yeah. And it would have been very different. I happened to get the side. I got the best roll for side, really. Because I happened to have three quite squishy things all together and your source without like a shoot at. Um, and I rolled quite well. Like I killed all the three things I charged, which doesn't often doesn't happen. No. Nope. Um, so it's a bit a bit ridiculous really but yeah that is more time it's a harsh brutal game mm. um, so um, yeah it's a victory for the Orcs again they still haven't lost yet I feel like this one's made out of luck rather than skill yeah. <laughs> um, but it's game only lost four so Phil probably wouldn't lose very much um, I reckon they will come out probably about the same really or you might even if they all survive you'll just get more more money. Just pay for Veskit. Pay for and be fine. So yeah, that's it. Sorry for the slightly dull game. But like I said, that happens. I might even not do this as an individual one. Tag it on there. Tag it onto the beginning of, the, of another one. We'll see. We'll see, what I, we'll see how I feel. Um, I probably won't do that actually because it'll be annoying. <laughs> I, like to have them all, I like to have them all separate.
It'll, yeah. just, it'll just be a short five minute game. We'll just put it, when I when I share it on Facebook, I'll say it's a very very short game. We'll just film us back in a way. For, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. From from the deployment and then film us back to from, from, from a, a box full of models. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, thanks a lot for watching our not very interesting game of more time. Hopefully, the next one will be a bit more exciting. Um, yep. Yeah. See you next time.